murder. Isn't that a commandment? It's a commandment. Murder is the fifth. And it doesn't just count if it's a person, it can count if it's a frog. Say, if you kill it for no reason, that's what I believe. You won't get a straight answer. Or we're hunting. Unless you eat it after. Or you could freeze it. But stealing that... Besides, even if it was on someone else's property, it isn't stealing if the peach falls from the tree. That's what my grandfather says. Well, your grandfather, okay? Anything that isn't attached to something else belongs to God. You don't believe in God. Don't I? You're an atheist, Grandpa. Well, you'll find as you get older, God starts to slip into the conversation. I'd like to be old. Yeah, just don't ever get feeling that you've lived too long. I won't. I'm off to the shed for a bit. Say nothing to your mother on the subject. My grandfather kept a stash of old newspaper clippings out there, which he liked to take out of their folders and read. My mother called it unseemly. Trash. He used to listen to old records out there. He collected stories about crime, murder mostly, but also brand larceny, rape, a story about a man who cut off his balls by accident, only it didn't say balls, it said a disfiguring accident involving an olive press. You need to read between the lines. Sometimes he'd let me look at his clippings. On a hot day, say when it was too hot for peach expeditions or going down to the trough. Horses used to water down there, back in the old days. You could just imagine it. You could. <laughs>